Hello, this is Finerato here to teach you today about things you need to be to learn that help to become a hacker. Uh, the first thing you need to even start the computer is you need a browser so that you can search the internet easily. I like Mozilla Firefox because you can customize it and you can make it faster and it has a lot of great hacking programs which I'll get into today. Uh, one of them is Firebug and Firebug allows you to look at the HTML the script right right is for what you want it to look so if I go down here and I change firebug to whatever I want and then I click up here it, look right here it'll say to whatever I want and <laughs> this is not this it won't when I refresh the page it won't save that way but it does help in other things the next thing is temper data which allows you to mess with the data as it inputs and I'm going to get into temper data in another tutorial about uh, hacking flash games and what it does is it changes the data that comes through so say you score uh, 655 on a game and you hit start tamper and when you hit submit the game it will you can change it to whatever score you want and it stays or you're voting for something you click it and you can temper it to change to however much you want and that would that work if it, it works very well um, the next thing you're going to need is oops is to learn HTML and HTML is the basic way that websites work it's it's how you write stuff down it's everything you see right around here and the words and links and stuff like that and what I this the place that really helped me learn was w3schools.com and this has everything from HTML to JavaScript to CSS to PHP which I'm going to also get into in later tutorials um, I also you should also read up on PHP tutorial from C from W3 schools and the CSS tutorial and the JavaScript tutorial. These are very basic things that you need to know. Uh, another good site to go to is hackthissite.org and hack this site has missions that allow you to go through and test your knowledge. This one requires HTML and I've already completed it and for some reason it saves my passwords. Oh oops I've already completed it and you put in the you look for the password you read it you look for the password and you submit it they also have uh, realistic missions which is hacking websites they made they have application missions they have programming missions they have JavaScript Stego and IRC uh, to really help you get into the hacking community what you would like to what you might want to do is you might want to find a place where you can talk to other hackers like you and these people will help you I know they've helped me a lot I am currently in a community right now uh, and if you would like I could give you guys the website thank you for watching I really hope you guys take this stuff into consideration Remember, for more information, go to finerado.weebly.com. Thank you for watching, and check out my other videos.